Hello there and welcome back to Avicoder Creative Mind. Are you really in search of a better font unlike the default font which Visual Studio Code provides you? So no worries at all, you are at the right place. Ok fine, so how does this font looks like? Isn't it amazing? Its name is Cascadia Code, this is officially provided by Microsoft on github so let me introduce this font to you again it's the latest cascadia code which is a version of monospace which has been provided by microsoft this is a really very good font because it helped me a lot to do my coding tutorials and videos it looks really very attractive and i love to use it in my visual studio code so in this tutorial we are going to learn that how we can set up this in our windows machine it's really easy and this tutorial is not going to be much longer i guess it's going to be less than five minutes so let's get started with any further delay all right so let's get started with the installation First go to your chrome or any browser and search for Cascadia code. In this case I am getting the first link which is the correct link of github. So click on it this is the official link. You need not to install this. All you can see this is the Cascadia code um, review how will this look like. These are the arrow supports, stylish seat and the uh, character sheet which characters will this support and finally in the installation tab you will get this link click on it it will open another uh, github repository in the asset click on this zip file to download it this is the file which contains all the cascadia codes font Let's double click on this zip file to unzip it. Now I'll click on unzip and I will unzip it in this directory currently. So you can see this is the unzipped folder and under this folder, okay so this one, then this is the folder which you need to go and you can see all the fonts, you just need to select all the fonts by just holding control and just doing it then right click and then you'll get an install option, click on it it will install all the cascadia font codes i uh, means font on your windows machine yep that's it it's successfully installed in your windows that was only this step now we need to configure the visual studio code setup so go to the settings of your visual studio code here under the font section you need to just type cascadia code make sure the spellings are correct so you can see as I have removed everything, uh, all the fonts has been removed. Now I have given Cascadia code and boom, you can see Cascadia code is now available. So that's it. That was how we can um, set up it in our Visual Studio code and make it install on our Windows machine. So I hope this tutorial would be very very informative for you. And this was a quick and short tutorial. I hope you get a great knowledge from it and it's a better way to code with this font so that's it for today's tutorial i hope you like this tutorial then please subscribe and like to abicode a creative mind so i'll see you in the next video till then take care and bye bye